What I've seen in Haiti these past days is unlike anything I've ever seen before. The sheer size and scope of this disaster is it's just overwhelming. When you drive through the streets, of course, you see all of the rubble. You smell decaying bodies buried underneath that rubble. There's garbage piling up everywhere. People are just desperate to reach out to anyone they can. Please help us. We have nothing. We have nothing left. As a photographer, there are people and moments that you witness that you can never forget. I may take 5,000 photographs, but some person, some face, someone will stay with me forever. Walking around photographing the victims, the, the halls were filled with people on stretchers, broken limbs, people crying in pain. It was, it was chaos. I saw a nun who was a nurse leaning over a young man, realized that she was giving him his last rites. She said that he knew what was happening and he was comforted and that he was not alone. But for me, he seemed very alone. He had no family. He was a number. He was just one of tens of thousands of people who were victims of this earthquake. But I will remember him forever. I watched him die and I can never forget that. Even though I see all this destruction around me, every day I see life to start to move forward a little bit in Haiti. You can see markets beginning to bustle. You can hear music playing in the camps. I believe that people are incredibly resilient, even when faced with such hardship, especially the Haitian people, and with the help of aid organizations and support from around the world. Haiti will begin to rebuild.